Hi, my name is Isa. Today I'm so excited to try out and to give you my thoughts on Lisa Eldridge's new lipsticks and lip liners. So um, I've bought two lipsticks and two lip liners, the same shade, uh, because you know they are quite expensive. I didn't want to um, splurge too much. Um, so I've got this uh, packaging from Lisa. Just so you know, with my package I've got um, Seamless Skin the foundation uh, sample and you actually get four different shades and you can see with which one you match and you can try it out. So I've tried, so I have on right now the number six and I'm so impressed with this foundation. I would really, really like to have it. Um, my skin never looked better. It is a seamless foundation, very lightweight. It's extremely beautiful. I'm really, really impressed with this one. <laughs> okay, so I feel like I need to add maybe a touch more of blush because these lights are washing me out. Okay, so um, I've bought two shades, a Velvet Blush Lightly and Velvet Cinnabar. Uh, you get your lipsticks in this cute, cute packaging and these are lip liners in the same shades. So I'm going to start with lightest shade, which is Velvet Blush Lightly. So as the name suggests, this is a softer and less intense version of the best-selling Velvet Blush. Um, a playful, wearable, medium muted berry tone, which evokes a just beaten lip flushed with color. So this cruelty-free product is free from parabens, tail, fragrance, D6, D5, gluten and alcohol. Of course, I'm starting with lip liner. Okay, so this is the lip liner and I have to say, it's so creamy. It's so easy to glide on your lips. Uh, but then quite quickly it sets and it's weird because it really doesn't budge. I mean, the other day, I mean yesterday, I just tried on the back of my hand um, and I couldn't remove it, <laughs> but it's not that feeling of dryness, you know, when something just sticks and won't budge, but it's making your lips dry at the same time, like it's sucking the water out of it. Um, yeah, so let's try it uh, now, lipstick. This packaging is so beautiful. So this is the lipstick, yeah, this looks really really nice, oh, this is so velvety, so let's try it on, oh wow, This is so comfortable on my lips and the color is gorgeous. <laughs> I think this is going to be my favorite for this autumn winter for like every day. This is so creamy and you know the matte lipsticks are usually so drying. It has a matte finish but it's so creamy and hydrating at the same time. I cannot wait to see how it lasts like all day long. This lipstick is something special also by the packaging. It's, it has this nice, 
it closes with magnet <laughs> let's try the other one now I'm going to try Velvet Cinnabar. Velvet Cinnabar is the deepest, richest, most powerful burnt ochre warm brown red imaginable. Okay, so let's try this one. But I'm going to do exactly the same as Lisa Eldridge did. So I'm going to first go in with a bullet and then I'm going to frame that lipstick with my lip liner. Okay, so it looks like this. It's so beautiful. Wow. Okay, because I have small lips, I like to do this. I mean, I'm not sure how she's doing it, but these lipsticks are just out of this world. I mean, you pay a lot, but you can really see the difference. <laughs> I mean, you can feel and see the difference. And, you know, sometimes when you try a high-end lipstick and it's, yeah, you can see that it's a little bit better, but it's not... A lot of time, maybe it's not worth it, if you know what I mean, because drugstore lipsticks are, like, better and better. Um, but this is, like, really, really luxurious, really something... I mean the shades, the feeling on lips. I don't have the most beautiful lips, but I feel like so pretty now. <laughs> so I'm going to probably update you with how it's wearing, uh, but I'm not sure. Maybe I'm going to um, write it in the info bar. Maybe I'm going to record it. I'm not sure yet. Uh, it depends on my day. Uh, I want to try now all of her velvet lipsticks uh all of her lip liners and i would so i would really love to have this foundation i mean this is really something you know and i wouldn't say that if i didn't mean it because i'm so picky with my foundation because i have very dry skin and i feel like i have nothing on my face almost every lipstick even the hydrating ones can dry out my lips. So I'm very curious how it's going to wear because right now this is so soft on my lips, so light, so comfortable um, and it's not drying my lips even though this is kind of velvety matte finish. I'm so, so impressed and Lisa is my like idol. She's so beautiful, so such a intelligent, like a great, great artist. I'm so, 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 so happy to have these two lipsticks. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then please like this video, subscribe to my channel, comment down below. Um, yeah, have a nice day and see you in my next video. Bye. Mm -hmm.